Okay, everyone, welcome back again to another video on Foxtech. This time I will guide you through the process of deleting photos from your iPhone storage without removing them from iCloud. This might seem a bit tricky at first, especially since Apple has designed their system to be seamless. So when you go to the Photos app, it's not immediately clear which photos are stored locally on your device and which ones are on iCloud. There are some subtle hints, like if a photo takes a moment to load or can't be accessed without the internet, but it's not explicitly marked. To start, if you want to delete photos from your iPhone but keep them in iCloud, you'll need to turn off syncing. This is a crucial step because when syncing is enabled, any change you make on your device is reflected on iCloud. So. To prevent this from happening, open the settings app on your iPhone and at the top you'll see the Apple ID section which displays your name, so tap on it and then go to iCloud and select Photos. In this section you'll find an option for synchronization. Make sure this is disabled. With the syncing turn off, your iPhone's photo library will be included in your device backup, but changes won't affect your iCloud. Once you've disabled syncing, you can manage your photos on your device without impacting iCloud. Deleting photos locally will free up space on your iPhone, while all your pictures remain safe and accessible in iCloud as well. This way, you can keep your iPhone's storage optimized without losing any precious memory stored in the cloud. I mean, a good tip to keep track of which photos are stored in iCloud is to check them out directly on iCloud website. Now, open Safari and go to iCloud.com, sign in with your Apple ID, you might just use the uh, Face ID to authenticate yourself and then navigate to the Photos section. Here you can clearly see all the photos stored in iCloud, helping you ensure that you're only deleting local copies from your device. Remember, it's always a good idea to back up your photos and data regularly so you don't do any accidental deletion. So I would highly recommend you to do a physical uh, backup, meaning that you back it up like locally on a computer. I do it like this all the time instead of iCloud, so that's how I like it. Hope you found this video useful. If you did, hit the thumbs up, subscribe below, and I'll catch you in the next one.